Despite soaring Omicron cases, U.S. holiday travel remains strong through the end of the year. Airline passenger counts even exceeded pre-pandemic levels on peak days. With vaccination rates high and Omicron symptoms appearing to be more mild, few travelers canceled their holiday trips. Let's take a look at the airline passenger counts and trends. Here's the latest passenger data from the U.S. Transportation Security Administration or TSA. This year's numbers are shown in orange and 2019 passenger counts are in blue. We're now down just 10% from 2019 levels. End-of-year holiday travel was very strong despite soaring case counts. Traveler numbers are at their highest levels since before the pandemic. The Delta wave peaked in mid-September with a seven-day moving average of over 150,000 daily cases. The Omicron wave has now eclipsed that level and headed higher as cases spike across the Midwest and Northeast. That trend is likely to continue well into the new year as the more contagious but less severe Omicron variant surges. Fortunately, U.S. vaccination rates continue to improve. With more than 204 million or 62 percent of the U.S. population vaccinated, traveler confidence remains solid. And seniors 65 years and older, the most vulnerable segment, are 88 percent fully vaccinated. That's building confidence for more holiday travel. The foundation of increased vaccination should support stronger U.S. airline traffic into 2022. However, this assumes the current vaccines remain effective against Omicron and other variants. By the end of the year, our forecast is that we remain down about 10% from 2019 levels. That's a firm foundation for the new year. We'll continue to update our forecast each week as more data becomes available.